On Thursday, George Brown, a drummer and lyricist who was instrumental in the formation of the band Cool and the Gang, passed away. His age was 74. CNN has received word via email from Jerry Digney, the publicist for Cool and the Gang, that the report is true. According to Digney, Brown fought cancer for a long time before he passed away in Los Angeles. Brown, Ricky Westfield, Ronald Bell, and his brother Robert Cool Bell, and neighborhood mates Spike Mickens, Dennis Thomas, and Charles Smith got together in 1964 and at first called themselves the Jazziacs. They started playing music that fused jazz, soul, and funk. After performing under a number of different names, such as The New Dimensions, The Soul Town Band, and Cool and the Flames, the group finally settled on Cool and the Gang in 1969 and began their career under that identity. Brown collaborated with the band on the writing of many of their most famous songs, including Ladies' Night, which was released on the band's album of the same name in 1979, as well as Tube Hot, Jungle Boogie, Summer Madness, Open Sesame, Celebration, and Cherish. The band received one Grammy Award in 1979 for their work on the soundtrack record for the movie Saturday Night Fever. They were also nominated for three Grammy Awards. In addition, they were inducted into the New Jersey Hall of Fame and the Songwriters Hall of Fame, and they earned seven American Music Awards, a BET Soul Train Lifetime Achievement Award, and the Songwriters Hall of Fame. The distinctive drumming that Brown played on the early Cool and the Gang albums has been sampled extensively in the years after those songs were released by a variety of musicians, including Beastie Boys, Jay-Z, Madonna, Janet Jackson, Cypress Hill, and The Killers, to mention just a few. Brown was a member of Cool and the Gang, which holds the record for the longest-running R&B group in the annals of music history until his retirement in August of this year. This year also saw the publication of Brown's autobiography, which was given the title Too Hot, Cool, and the Gang, and Me. According to a statement that was sent out by his publicist this week, whenever the musician was questioned about the nature of his work, he always responded that it was the sound of happiness. Brown is survived by his wife Han Brown and their five sons after his passing. At the beginning of this year, a diagnosis of stage 4 lung cancer was given to Brown. Nearly 60 years after starting Cool and the Gang in New Jersey with his brothers Robert Cool Bell and Ronald Bell, Dennis D.T. Thomas, Robert Spike Mickens, Charles Smith, Woodrow Woody Sparrow, and Ricky West, he decided to retire due to his condition. He was joined in the group by Ronald Bell, with their lively fusion of jazz, funk, bar and b, and soul music, the band has amassed millions of record sales and two Grammy Awards over the course of the previous six decades. Brown not only played drums for the band, but also contributed to the composition of many of their most successful songs, such as Celebration, Ladies' Night, Jungle Boogie, Get Down On It, and Too Hot. His induction into the Songwriters Hall of Fame took place in the year 2018, and Cool and the Gang's induction into the New Jersey Hall of Fame took place in the year 2015. Robert Bell is the only original member of the band who is still alive at this point.